Hello guys, so this is Arnon Widget here and I just want to share some things about you about finding your passion and what you need to do to stop sabotaging yourself from finding your passion. And one thing that really stands out to me is when, you know, I do talk to people about what I'm passionate about a lot and I do notice that they really don't tend to focus on that and, you know, that's completely understandable because there's a lot of people that are not going to be focused on what you're passionate about. But when you're but when you're having problems with finding your passion, what makes you think you're going to find your passion when you're not focusing on what they're saying about their passion or you're not really engaged in what they're saying? Um, that's a really you know, that's a big problem, you know, towards the law of attraction, because if you're you're putting that type of energy out to the universe, what's going to happen when you find your passion? You know, you're going to attract a lot of people that are not really interested in what you're what you're saying. Um, or actually help supporting or, or just pretty much congratulating you on that and excited about you finding your passion. So that's that's tip number one of, of how to, you know, really be in the vibration of finding your passion. Now, another thing is about your passion is you have to be in the vibration of your passion. Now, what I mean is that a lot of people are saying that they want to do this and do that but they're not actually acting or living in that vibration of that, that energy. And so if you if you want to do, um, you know, if you want to build playhouses, you know, what are you doing every day? Are you just living day to day? You need to be in the vibration of trying to um, build those things and trying to work on that every day and actually understand a desire. And that should be the, your mode of uh, conversation every day as well. You should be reading up and doing whatever you can and taking action on those things every day consistently so you can actually be in a vibration of what you're passionate about. Can I see a lot of people talk about their passion about something, but they are really not taking a lot of actions towards that. And I think the last thing about finding your passion is about, you know, just actually being, a, having the awareness of what you're passionate about. What is it? that you're really strongly passionate about? Do you have a lot of things that you're passionate about? Or do you just have one thing that you're passionate about? You can be passionate about many things, but there's gotta be something that's very, you know, that really burns really deep inside of you that's really, that you're passionate about. There's gotta be something that's really, really important to you. And once you find that that's really, really important to you, that is your passion in life. And so if you can write down a piece of paper, how many things that you're passionate about, good, that you can be passionate about, but what is one thing that really sticks out to you that makes you really, really passionate about it? You know, all you have to do is make a decision. And so the, the main thing, the main tip or the last tip that I gave you, which is really the main tip, is that you have to find strongly what the main passion is that you have and make a decision that that is the passion of my life. And so I hope that this va this video actually helps you, <laughs> video, video, but I hope this video actually helps you about finding the focus to your passion and understanding that you need to be in a vibration of that and actually congratulate on people finding their passion. You know, start asking them what make them find their passion. You know, it could be a life experience or whatever, but you need to understand that that's how you actually find your passion because you know it's going to come in different ways for everybody but you got to make a decision on what you're strongly passionate about so you can actually be in connection with the source of being in alignment with your true life purpose and so my name is Arnon Woodgett and I hope you got value out of this video and feel free to share this with anybody you may know and I will see you on the next video bye bye